Nothing is what it seems. Nothing. Y'all see the picture? Y'all see it. Victoria is Eli's sneaky link. Yes. What in the heck is going on? Now, what could this all mean? And in this scene, he told her, I miss you so much. So this ain't the first time. Oh, no. I am just shocked out of my mind. Shocked out of my mind. Now, I can say I initially thought that the cliffhanger was going to be Sam because Sam had a seizure right there in the hospital bed because the nurse came and dropped something into the IV bubble. But I think that he was just tripping. I think he was like stressed out or something because he thought that the metal taste in his mouth was poison right and you know priscilla was trying to assure him that that's not what it was but i don't know we'll have to wait till next week to see that part so let's get back to eli and miss victoria here so at the very end of the episode i thought she was looking for hunter because when she came to the door she was flirting with the guards is he in there is he in there she was talking to the guards outside the door so they said, well, yeah, he's in there. So of course, we've seen her come to Hunter's door many a times and, you know, to go in to see him. So she stepped in with this long blue teddy on, this negligee, and, you know, she's got a night clothes on. So of course, I'm thinking she's going to see Hunter, but it was Eli sitting on the couch, Eli. So she stepped in and he told her, look, I ain't got time for your ish tonight, Victoria. Just get the H out of here. Get out of here. I don't have time for it. What are you doing? So she gave him this little spark. She opened up that little robe she had on. And he, the way he looked at her, like the initial look, I was like, mm, Eli, what, what does that look for? What, you know, you don't look at another man's wife in that way so the way he was looking he had the head tilted i'm like okay well, what's going on here so soon after that he grabbed her started kissing on her and said i miss you so much oh my goodness guys what could this mean what could this mean now the battle between good and evil has eli leading his team right into a booby trap Clearly, just when everyone thinks that it's safe, Victoria strikes again. Victoria is a whole W-H-O-R-E. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> and I'm sure this has everything to do with Hunter because Hunter is a W-H-O-R-E too. He's just the male version of it, right? And I've said this before. I think it was back in season two. It may have been season three, but she doesn't have any friends, number one. She doesn't go outside the White House at all. So if she's going to have an affair and fool around on Hunter, it's going to be with someone there in the White House. So who better to fool around with than the Secret Service man who's there to protect and serve you? But now she's got Eli wrapped around her finger. And we really should have seen this coming, guys, because... When he first entered onto the scene, like her insults were very strong, very strong. But I don't know, there we, we, we couldn't have seen this coming. I'm just trying to make sense of it all, you guys. You know, her calling her kids, you know, nappy headed kids. And I'm just going back in my mind here, right in this moment to try to figure out what could this all mean? Because this turns the entire storyline on its head. I mean, it's so unexpected right so what do you guys think this is this means here i i can't put two and two together with this one because none of it makes sense but it's very very interesting it's very interesting to say the least what is simone gonna say what is hunter gonna say when he finds out you know was he in on you know killing jason i you know i have so many questions now because in hindsight i'm thinking huh you know how much involved how involved is he like you know with all this stuff so i guess in the next episode or the episode after that um this is probably when kyle is going to say they're all in one place um probably at the president's house because he's gathering everyone there is from what i saw tonight because uh, nancy is there sharon is there uh richard left he's going to look for barry barry done went to the game so they can't find him <laughs> 
where in the heck did Barry go? And he, he was pissed off when he left. So I don't know. It's a whole lot going on on the Oval tonight, you guys. I hope that you guys had a chance to look at it. I won't give you any more spoilers. So if you haven't had a chance to look at it, check it out. And of course, stay tuned for my scene by scene review, breakdown, commentary of the Oval season four, episode number three, Into the Woods. Thank you so much for joining me on this episode of Ruthless TV. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. You know I'd appreciate it. And if you're an Oval fan, go ahead and sub to this channel because I do video breakdowns like this all the time. Thank you so much once again, you guys, and I'll see you on the next one.